All right, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Redfish Blue Tail. For those who don't know me, my name is Mark. And I think this video is gonna actually have today, uh, which I caught one redfish on a flood tide. As you can see, there's still some water in the flat uh, on the fly. And then I went out two days ago and caught one on rod and reel and one on the fly. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put all three fish in this video. And I'll start you guys with two days ago. What an incredible crystal clear day it was. Today's a little windy, you got some clouds and some overcast. And I think the fish didn't want to play today. I saw one, I got one. So, well, I, I saw one and I got one. Not got two, got one. By the way, I appreciate you guys following along. Let's start with two days ago. Here we go, later. All right. Hopefully I can get over these vines right here. Guys, I'm on. Oh shit, he's right here. He's right underneath me. There he is. All right, guys. I, oh, it looks like he's coming towards me too. You can see the ripples in the water over there like a big swirl just happened and then I thought I saw a fish moving towards this way I'm just gonna hang here for a minute he could have hung around that tall grass in there and that was the biggest that's the biggest swirl I've seen in in a minute it was just right up here on that grass point right there and I thought I saw the fish push through. I thought I saw him go that way, but then I saw something messing right over here. That was a big fish. I suppose it could have been a big mullet, but I doubt it. Ooh, is that him right there? There was a swirl there and a swirl. Oh, there he is right there, guys. Oh shit. Take it easy. Dang it. There he goes. Oh yeah. Oh shit, he's right here. He's right underneath me. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> I thought I saw something over here. What a fish. Chunk, dude. Look at the size of you. Look at that. Just a chunk. Got him on that. I strike jig. Look at the size of that tail. Look at that. All right, buddy, let's get you released. Let's let him go right over here. What a big boy. There you go, buddy. Boom. All right, guys, well, I found one out here. I mean, it took a while. I was, I've been seeing a lot of free swimming fish. Usually see them tailing, but I, it's knee deep right here, which is just above perfect uh, water depth. The water temp has dropped the last couple days. We had some really cold weather uh, over the weekend and a lot of cold rain. Um, today's kind of the warmest day it's been in about four or five days and no wind too. Uh, I've seen the fish out of here actually. I think there, there goes my guy over there. I think that's him, I don't know. I may have to catch him again. Um, 
But first day back out here, I've thrown the fly a few times. I've been denied. Uh, I don't know if it's on camera, but the one fish actually went up and nosed the, the, the fly and then he kind of spooked off. But uh, I'm gonna continue to try to use the fly. Uh, I mean, high tide was like an hour and a half ago and you can see we've had such big tides that they're still here. So I'm just gonna kind of keep uh, moving around, keep looking for some fish and hopefully get one on the fly. I'd love to get one on rod and reel and fly today. Later. All right, he's just there, guys. He's right off my rod. All right, guys, he's pushing through this grass. You can probably see him right there. He kind of made a turn at me, y'all. You see the fish? He's about three feet behind my fly. froze here he is that's super important to watch my shadow You guys can see him bumping that grass right there. Oh man, I'm like a little too far to the left. Oh, he's coming at me. Oh, guys, I'm on. That was an awesome eat. It's a strong fish, man. These fall fish are, they're full, they're strong, and they're getting ready for winter. I mean, I can feel that in my arms. He does not want to play. Guys, that may be my biggest ever on the fly. I don't know. We're just gonna call it that way. What a fish. What a fish. There we go. Guys, look at the size of this chunk. No, hold on, bud. We got to get you a proper release. I'm just digging through there, man. All right, guys, that site cast fishing company. I'm gonna, I was throwing the purple the other day. I think I might go back to it because it's cloudy. It, they weren't hitting it on the sunny, on the sunny day, and they were, they, they, I did catch that one on this. Looks like that guy just got demolished. Either way, I'm gonna go purple today, just feeling it, and then uh, switch to the tan if, if we need to. All right, guys, well, it started raining out here just to add insult to injury. I mean, I am not seeing anything. What a difference two days makes. Bluebird skies the other day, fish everywhere. I saw them everywhere. I was actually kind of running over them with my paddle board and they weren't even spooked. I mean, they, I, I have multiple videos of fish just cruising right underneath my paddle board. Um, I'm a bit shocked there's nothing out here today. You would think with a little cloud cover and, and a little bit cooler weather, these guys would be getting uh, like, ready for fall and winter and fattening up and here comes the rain man uh good thing i brought my rain jacket uh it was raining a little bit earlier today so 
All right, I'm just gonna keep trying. All right, guys, you can see him kind of coming at me over here. Right there. His exit may be right here. Man, this is gonna be tough. I need him to kind of go the direction he's going. Now he's going left. He kind of went for it. He turned. You guys can see him belly crawling right here. I'd like for him to come out here. That'd be awesome. That's a decent sized fish right off my rod. He may see it right now. Oh, he's like, the fly is stuck on the grass above him. He didn't even see it. Look at him right there. Perfect. I just want him, I'm just going to be patient and let him come right here. Oh, yeah. You guys can see him belly crawling through. I mean, he's like coming at me, guys. Look at this. He's right here. I mean, he's about to nose bump my fly in just a second. Oh my gosh, that was insane. That was insane. Please tell me that's recording. Yes. What an eat that was. This is a fish, y'all. This is a fish. This is a nice fish. He's right here. Oh, he just, <laughs> He literally just ran into my foot. Wow, oh, don't get around the... I thought he was going to catch my fin. I mean... Guys, what in the shit? What a fish. Let's get you released, buddy. Oop. I lost him, guys. He might be underneath my board. <laughs> guys, if that's the only fish I catch or see all day, that eat was and he slammed it oh my god that was incredible guys he came out right there that's the creek right there 10 yards to my to my right he came through here i waited till he got brought right here i was a little impatient because he cut back into the tall stuff i really wanted him right here but man it was crazy like he just kind of slow mode up to it and then he just goes and he just took it I wish I could have gotten a nice release, but he just kind of flopped out of me. I'm going to stand up and see if I can see him because sometimes after a fight like that, they'll just kind of stay right underneath you. Water got really muddy, so he may, he may have moved on, but oh man, I just like to get like, and I, oh, look right here, guys. There he is. I just looked over and saw a tail sticking up. Oh, shit. I got you. Oh, there he goes. He knew. Here he goes. He's bouncing grass. That's what I mean by bouncing grass, guys. You see that? Oh, he just knows me. I got him. I got him. And there we go, guys. That's three fish from the last two days. I'm assuming we probably have like maybe a week's left of weather before all the bait gets out of here. I mean, this creek, I didn't see any bait on the flat today. No fiddler crab. So things are changing. And when the bait leaves, the redfish leave. They just, and they start schooling up at low tides, uh, hundreds of fish together. So water's cool enough, enough, enough that they may start like, understanding all right guys it's time to change our pattern so that's it for today guys appreciate you following along uh if you haven't and you want to why don't you hit that subscribe button and just follow us along quit making me beg for these things all the time all right y'all later